Hi, welcome to GST reconciliation demo in Delhi Prime. So nowadays people are doing a GST reconciliation for their data in Tally. They are doing it in a multiple ways. Some people are exporting Tally data into another tool. Some people are downloading the JSON files from the GST portal, then uploading and doing a reconciliation. Some people using Excel data, they are uploading to Tally and then they are doing a reconciliation. So now what if we are going to show this tool will help you to do a GST reconciliation in Tally Prime itself within a two minutes by clicking three buttons. So let's have a demo. Go to display more reports, GST reports. Here you can see new menu name is live GST 2A to be reconciled. So here four menus are there. One is the GST 2A reconciled, one, one more is to be reconciled, and one is the virtual ledger configuration and one more GST portal credentials. So now here you go to GST portal credential, just keep your GST username. We don't need your password to get the data. Only to ask you OTP authentication. So you have to share, put your OTP in Tally itself to download your data directly into your Tally. So just accept the screen. Now let's see what is this menu. So suppose some people will spend the expenses or any some bank related entries. Sometimes they may forgot or they are not aware somebody has filed using our GST number, some expenses or whatever we spent. So those kind of entries if you want to post into your tally, that time you need a which ledger it has to go, this kind of all information. So further, this is the screen where you can configure which ledger, what tax rate it has to take. Suppose if it is a 5% tax rate, which ledger it has to take. If it is a 18%, what tax ledger it has to go like that. So this is the screen is not only fixed while posting entry also again it will ask you want to put it any expense ledger instead of such as a ledger you can choose it the respect to expense ledger and you can book the entry. For, for that purpose this is the ledger configuration. Now let's go to GST 2 year reconcile report. Here by default it will show you for that month what entries you posted in your books for supplies. All will appear here not only supplies even expenses also. So to get the data from directly from GST portal, just click get 2A data. Whenever you click, it will ask you, do you want to download a portal 2A data? Once you say yes, then it will ask you OTP, whatever you received on your phone or your email ID. So just to feed that OTP, whatever you received from GST department to pull, pull the data from GST portal to your tally directly. Just I am entering the OTP. Well, after entering, then it will start downloading the data from your portal. So automatically it will post it. It will show you that portal data is downloaded successfully. Total number of invoices loaded is 10 for the month of April. After accepting, you can see all your portal data has come here. So now you have to do only one more button to start matching. Click this button. It will start matching whatever the invoices are matching as per your portal and your books. It will complete the matching. So you can see these all vouchers got matched. This is a partial match. There is a tax reference. You can see. Suppose if you want to see the GST number for these uh, entries, then you can go to configuration. Then you can click show GST number. You can keep it as. Then automatically it will show you the GST number also each portal entry wise. So like this. You can complete your GST reconciliation within a two minutes by clicking three buttons. But till now I showed only two buttons. One more button. You want to freeze the this reconciliation for this month, then just click a save a reconciliation. That's it. Save reconciliation. I completed. So then automatically all they will show as accepted. Whatever is there in your books, it is not filed by your supplier, then it will be pending. It will carry forward to next month. This is all the same. Portal also will go carry forward until you take it or you can set the status whether you want to climb that one or suppose if you say I know it's ineligible or something then you can set the status then it will remove from your books until then it will carry forward for the next month next month also I can go I can again do the reconciliation of my data previous water month whatever were pendings were there it will carry forward to next month here also again if you can get the 2A data directly using the using the button so here you can click suppose some people will ask i want to download a three months data at a one shot then just go to here just change the period 
to the six months i'll just keep the three months suppose i am keeping it 30 june so it's a my period is a three months now whenever i click a get to a data download then automatically system will start downloading your data for the three months it one shot so may month is downloaded now june month also download just i kept a two months only actually if i keep a three months period it will download for three months so you can see all two months related data at one click you can see all your data so this is a how you can do gst 2a or 2b 2b also same same fashion you can do a gst reconciliation in tally prime using this module and one more last one is suppose if you want to post the entry as i explained suppose i want to book this expense entry then you can select it and use the option post voucher then automatically it will ask you do you want to post voucher yes then it will ask you which voucher type you want to use whatever voucher type you want to use you can use it and the ledger suppose if you want to put in such ledger if you want to keep the expense ledger you can use it then i can just accept then automatically that entry got posted and it is started showing in your gs.2 a reconciliation report same fashion you can do gs.2 b also reconciliation within two minutes by clicking this three button get to a data start matching save reconciliation suppose if you want to post the entries select the entry and click a post watcher suppose if you want to post 10 entries one shot select all 10 and click a post watchers that's it like this you can complete your gst reconciliation in tally prime within a two minutes by clicking three buttons thanks for watching the demo of gst 2a 2b reconciliation report in tally prime for more details please contact us